Good afternoon, this is Match Day Live from Rams TV and we are back at Pride Park as Derby County are looking to make it three in a row. Visitors this afternoon are Cambridge United and the two sides about to emerge into the arena ahead of this League One fixture this afternoon. As the ball comes in towards the box this time, it's away by Collins. And Mendes Lang has just got away from the defender here. And this could be a really good early opportunity for Derby County. It's Mendes Lang into Barkhazen now. It's Barkhazen! And the goalkeeper makes the block. Mendes Lang can't get there. Bennett it is who scrambles it clear. And it was nearly a goal in the first 60 seconds of the contest. Well, what a break that was from Mendes Lang. The ball skipped off the surface, and at that point it was up to the Cambridge players to try and get back behind the ball. Mendes Lang drove forward, it just slowed down at the wrong time for him. He found Barquez and left foot, and the keeper made a decent save. Well, we continue with Derby on the offensive anyway. Mendes Lang forward, Waghorn is forward. Who can Collins pick out here? Collins checks his run, it's Mendes Lang just inside the edge of the penalty area. Mendes Lang touches it back to Corey Smith. Here is Tyrese Fauna, he's being urged to shoot. He does shoot, and he shoots just wide off the post in the ends. That's unlucky from Fauna. I think he was looking down this left-hand side. Fozzie hadn't joined in the attack. He gets his head up, they look, Fozzie's not there. Chops back in on his right foot and goes for that far post. It's a decent strike. But to be fair, I think Mannion had it covered. They just took the sting out of the game with the injury and the change. Well, the ball goes forward now. It's a terrific ball forward as well. Mendes Lane wants it. It comes in. Barkhazen's effort. That's blocked edge of the six-yard box. Brilliant work from Namambi on that right-hand side. And it was Barkhazen that found himself unmarked in the box, struck it well enough, hard and low. I think it took a little deflection and a block to keep it out. Well, on 31 minutes following the death of Josh Vickers' wife, Laura, everyone inside this stadium stands and applauds. In a statement this week, Josh said she was the strongest, bravest and most loving person. Corner, Nyambi in towards Barkhazen here. Barkhazen had a little look, tried to cut the ball back. It's gone behind for a corner kick as we enter a minimum five minute stoppages here. Well, this movement all afternoon has been very good. Corner plays it to Nyambi. It's a clever ball down that wide right area. My argument would be don't worry about looking up too often, just whip the ball across goal, don't wait for the run. Sometimes we could be too clever trying to pick someone out. Derby corner then in stoppage time. Waghorn to deliver it in towards that near post. There it comes off the post. Nelson trying to put it back in towards goal. Well, the woodwork saves Cambridge United and Tyrese Fauna has gone over holding his leg here and was signalling to the bench straight away. That's a yeah, concern. It is because he's been excellent in the first 45 minutes. Was it Fauna who came off last in front of goal? It's a brilliant ball from Martin Waggon. There's four or five players competing at that first ball. Borna, I think, that gets the last touch. There's the touch, comes off the post, and Nelson can't get to it quick enough to get the sh second shot off. Waghorn, they're making ground. Here's Mendes Lang. Mendes Lang with one step over, drives it across. We'll go out for a corner kick. I'm just looking. I'd like Nambi to be a little bit more positive when the ball goes down that right-hand side. I think he could support Mendes Lang and maybe go on the overlap if you think of the joy that's coming down the left. Mendes Lang with that ball in. Well, Collins met it, and Collins looks to the sky. It was a free header, and it's one that he has buried time and time again in his career. Great ball from Mendes Lang ahead of any defender and to be fair to him he did try and direct it across goal and it just hit the defender so having a look at the bench down below us Louis Sibley is getting ready 
for who we will bring you in a moment because at the moment Mendes Lang is taking on the fullback. Mendes Lang gets the ball in, head up from Wakorn, down and up and over the crossbar. Well, Mendes Lang has burst into life the last five minutes or so. Probably when he got that kick, you know, all of a sudden, every time he gets it, he's putting wonderful deliveries into the box. What a cross that was, and what a chance for Martin Waghorn. Seven or eight yards out, free header. Gets it completely wrong, heads down, and it bounces over the bar. It's the best chance for a while. Dibley is a short option. Opts to play it back here to Nyambi. Mendes Lang again here. Mendes Lang to take on Gordon, who needs to be careful. In towards Sibley. Sibley plays that ball in towards the six-yard box. It was not an effort that was going to really trouble the goalkeeper. Uh, but it's a quick effort for Louis Sibley. Good little play from Mendes Lang. Nyambi. Mendes Lang being patient, steps inside the pitch, little reverse. He just can't get the shot off with real pace. Smith with the ball forward. This is a had me. Brophy. Ball goes out wide now, and it's driven across. Oh, and it comes all the way through to the other fullback, Andrew here. Andrew cuts that ball back. May couldn't get on top of it. It's driven in, and the goalkeeper makes a save, and it's a good one-handed save to deny Paul Digby. Joe Wildsmith gets a touch in the first place, and it comes back to Andrew. Again, just trying to be too cute, picking someone out. We've got four players running towards goal. That's the second save. And it's Cambridge United who pick up a point that they will be much the happier with of the two teams that we've seen on display here this afternoon. In full-time score here, Derby County nil, Cambridge United nil.